Hello everyone, it's Mushmonkey here and today I've got a video on how to fix the session lost issue that some of you have been experiencing since the new Steam update and BattleEye update that came out a few days ago. So the first thing you want to do is you want to navigate to the Armour 2 uh, Operation Arrowhead folder that can be found within your Steam directory. Usually speaking this is within C program files Steam. Um, in some instances you may have installed Steam to a different location. But anyway, pop into the expansion folder, into the BattleEye folder, and then double click the uninstall BE application. If it asks you if you want to make changes, click yes. When it asks to uninstall, click yes again. Uh, in my instance it left a couple of files, so just pop them, delete them, you don't need them. Uh, you can then come straight out of this folder, and uh, what you want to then do is you want to open up Steam and in Steam you want to right click on Armour 2, Operation Ahead, click Properties, choose Local File tab and then within the local files uh, you want to click Verify Game Cache and that what that do is it just verify the integrity. It, in my instance it asks to uninstall Armour 2 up at the Czech Republic expansion so I just said yes to that. Um, it will then validate and this can take 5, 10, 15 minutes so just be patient. Once it's finished uh, verifying and validating, it may download a few files. In my instance, it downloaded uh, six files, which I imagine is the BattleEye installation. So the next part of the tutorial is just to jump over to your C drive. Now I actually go into my D drive like an idiot, but go to your C drive, go into your program files 86 folder and visit the common files folder. In there you'll find the BattleEye folder. You can either delete the file folder itself or you can go into that folder and delete all the files in it. But you just need to get rid of that folder so that it's not there. The next step is to visit the local uh, folder in your app data. The easiest way to get there in my experience is just to go to the bar and type percent app data percent and press enter. This will take you to your roaming app data folder. So what you want to do is you want to click app data at the top like I do and then go into your local folder. And in here, you'll see Armour 2 and Armour 2 Operation Arrowhead. Now you want to go into the Armour 2 OA folder. So once you've gone into the Armour 2 OA folder, you want to go into the BattleEye folder and delete the beclient.dll file. Once you've done that, that is basically all of the things you need to do. What you then want to do is you want to pop back over to Steam and you want to click play Armour 2 Operation Arrowhead. What this will do is it will install the basic stuff for Armour 2 again, including BattleEye. So agree to the terms accept that and it'll obviously allow it to make any changes to your computer and that's basically everything you need to do guys and um, just let the game load up all the way up to this main menu and then all you need to do is simply exit and um, once you've exited the game you can then open up your favorite launcher ccg launcher daisy launcher whatever launcher you happen to use and then you should hopefully be able to connect to the server that you normally play on uh, you'll see me do that in a second. I, I play on the CCG Overpark EU1 server um, and I had the issue. I did the steps in the video and it fixed my, my issues completely. So if this video did help you, uh, please smash that subscribe button, uh, leave a like. Uh, if it didn't help or if there's any problems you've still got, leave a comment down below. I'll be more than happy to try and help you guys out. And uh, I will see you guys in the in the next video.